What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Libra, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free channel for reading for all signs, or for the sign of Libra, sorry. This is going to be at least any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine energy for your chart. Now we get the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't fall out of flat, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general for reading for Sonal Libra. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're at 13,240 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 5 The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash up, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. I do not publicly display your name for privacy and um, confidentiality purposes to donate. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to your channel. If you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to donate. I meant feel free, feel free to share it very publicly via social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys. Okay. So I received one channel message as I was meditating on your um, um, your um, July of 2022 reading. And uh, I heard um, Cosmetic um, procedure is about to backfire, is what I heard. Um, many complications just now, many complications. Cosmetic procedure about to backfire, many complications. So, you know, if it's not you, it could be somebody you're connected to, but somebody's cosmetic procedure is about to com um, have complications, many complications. Uh, whatever whatever cosmetic procedure that is and however that resonates and applies there, Libra, it could be you that had this cosmetic procedure or somebody you're connected to. I, I mean, whatever it is, I don't know if it's the tummy tuck, breast augmentation, Botox, um, liposuction. I mean, I don't know. I've never had any cosmetic procedure ever a day in my life, so I'm not familiar with any of that. And that's just the truth. But somebody has, whether it's a Libra or somebody you're connected to, Libra, and it's about to experience a lot of complications, all of that resonates. For some, it could be sex change, possibly. Um, I've been, I was pulling in sex change energy in um, somebody else's reading. So, you plug it in, how it resonates. Spirit messages you have signed of Libra. These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, so one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply, only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. So you have to plug it in how it resonates, okay? Scorpion, golden egg, fish chakra, which is throat chakra, disappointment in a friend or lover, pay attention to your work, taking a vacation physically or mentally. Spirit so messages you have sound like A cancer feminine is about to find a hidden camera in her bedroom soon. It's about to create many, 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 many series of same events. A shitstorm is about to occur. Okay, I heard a cancer fem is about to find a hidden camera in her bedroom. And um, it sounds like once she hasn't found the hidden camera in her bedroom yet, but once she does, a shitstorm is about to occur. So, I hope you didn't implant the hidden camera in her bedroom, Libra. Only you know if you implant hidden devices in people's spaces or not. I don't know. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But it's coming in in your in your reading. So maybe you voyeur through this creepy hidden camera through somebody's bedroom, or 
you know somebody that implanted the hidden uh heat creepy hidden camera through somebody's bedroom it's a cancer fem or you're about to learn of the creepy hidden can camera that was in the cancer fem's bedroom she's about to find it soon she hasn't found it yet and i did pull in a hidden camera energy in a uh, cancer fem's bedroom in cancer's reading but i heard once she finds it it's going to create uh, basically a shitstorm. So how somehow you're connected to this, or at least one of you guys is, so you plug that in, how it resonates. Number 39 can be a very significant number in one's life. Number 39, it can be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, or any other significant number. Number 39. For some, you've been de dealing with a water sign. You have water sign energy strong in here. Scorpio energy, if you are, they can have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Men, Hebrew, Jupiter charts. One of you guys is dealing with a Cancer fam. And I'm just being for real, or you know her, or something like that. Scorpion. A betrayal from an Aquarius and a Scorpio is about to become very, very, very significant in a Libra's life. Life altering. And it's about to come soon. Know this. And a cancer. Okay, I heard a betrayal from a cancer, a Scorpio, and an Aquarius is about to become very life-altering in a Libra's life soon. Life-altering um, soon and quickly. So you're about to get stung with the scorpion tail. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, betrayal energy. Ten of swords energy. Um, some by a cancer. Some by a... Aquarius, some by a um, Cancer, Aquarius, and uh, who was the other one? Scorpio. So you plug it in, how it resonates. They could have Cancer, uh, Scorpio, or Aquarius in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Henry, Jupiter, Charge. You plug it in, how it resonates. Information is about to explode, 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 explode. For some, you're going to help it explode. For some, you don't want it to explode. But it's about to happen. Okay, I heard information is about to explode, 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 explode. For some, you don't want it to explode, but for some, you do, and you're about to help it happen. So for some, you're going to help the information explode. So you have, you have to plug yourself in where you fit. Are you high vibrational? Are you going to help it explode? Are you low vibrational? You want to keep it hidden, secret covered up blah 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 um you plug yourself in where you fit the betrayals are lover related groupie related swinger related the betrayals are lover related groupie related and swinger related so one of you guys is into groupies and polyamorous type situation, I'm presuming. Or um, something of that nature or multiple lovers or sneaky links or situationships or what have you, what have you. Um, secret lover energy. Hell, I don't know. I haven't had sex in three years. You only you know your story ain't anybody else. But um, so it's in the love department there, but toxic love department. Um, groupies, swingers, secret lovers. Um, Anybody can have that shit. It's just nasty. Golden egg. I know for some of you guys, you aren't like that. But somebody, at least one Libra up in here is. And that's just the truth. For one Libra, Libra lawyer, masculine. The divorce paperwork is about to come very soon. A lot sooner than you thought. One out of this shithole. Oh, okay. I heard for one Libra lawyer, masculine Libra lawyer, um, the divorce paperwork is about to come a lot sooner than um, this Libra masculine lawyer thought. They want out of this shithole. So this is singing with the divorce paperwork is what I'm feeling. Um, I don't know if it's going to be contested or non-contested. I'm not sure. I'm not the spouse of this Libra masculine lawyer. Um I'm presuming probably non-contested because I'm sure there's a lot of asset, assets and properties and things of that nature um, and a lot of money um, in this. I'm pretty sure there is. 
Um, so I'm pretty sure it'll be non contested. Um, when me and my ex husband got divorced, it was um, it was non contested only because he wanted to fight over the kids, not because we had money. We only had fifty thousand dollars in the bank, and we split it twenty five and twenty five. That is nothing compared to some people, and that's just the truth. Golden egg. A Libra is about to learn of somebody that has won the uh, lottery jackpot. A Libra is about to learn of someone that won the lottery jackpot. So if this resonates for you, Libra, it's not you, it's somebody you're connected to, but you're about to learn they they won the lottery jackpot, so the jackpot winning, uh, the big dog, I'm presuming. Um, so golden egg in this aspect is the lottery jackpot winning, um, which is a big ass winning. Um, congrats, whoever that's for. Uh, it's not you, it's somebody you're connected to. Uh, golden egg winning the jackpot. And a Libra lawyer is about to get a lot of consultations regarding hidden cameras in people's homes in the past and an illegal case study done on a family in the past. It is about to make your business go up in a huge way. I'm pulling this Libra masculine lawyer in very strong. Okay, And a Libra masculine lawyer is about to get um, a lot of um, consultations, I heard, regarding a hidden camera in a family's home in the past regarding an illegal case study that was done on them and hidden cameras in other people's homes. Um, so secret voyeurism and harassment and gang stalking and bullying, um, how that resonates. That's terrible. Wolf. Through many series of chain of events, many people are about to go to jail for this. And it's going to cause this Libra masculine lawyer to contact an Aquarius masculine lawyer to help out a feminine energy. Okay, I heard many people are about to go to jail for this and it's going to cause a Libra masculine lawyer to contact an Aquarius masculine lawyer to help out a feminine energy. So maybe the feminine energy had a... Um, hidden camera in her house in the past maybe nobody told her is what i'm presuming or nobody gave her the information but it sounds like people are giving the information out now about hidden cameras but didn't want to help somebody that had an illegal case study done on their in their damn house through a hidden camera or a hidden camera in their house period but yet the person that or people that help people locate the hidden cameras i mean where's the imbalance in that just saying wolf The Secret Seven is about to become very, 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 very public, very, in a negative aspect for these people, very soon and very quickly. Very public. The Secret Seven is about to become very, 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 very public, in a negative aspect for these people very soon, very public. So, wolf pack energy, wolf puke energy, blah, 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 blah. A husky is about to become very significant in Libra's life. And a stuffed wolf is about to become very significant in Libra's life. Okay, I heard a husky is about to become very significant in Libra's life. And a stuffed wolf is about to become very significant in Libra's life. So some kind of stuffed wolf energy and a husky. So uh, I think an actual wolf wolf dog. Um, whoever you are, Libra. It might be your dog or somebody you're connected to's dog. Some kind of husky. And they're beautiful dogs. They really are. I feel this husky could be a positive influence in your life or a negative one. You plug it in, how it resonates. Fish chakra, Archangel Gabriel.
A Libra is about to apologize to someone soon. Libra masculine. Huge regret here. A Libra masculine is about to um, apologize to someone soon. Huge regret here. So a Libra masculine has huge regret over something. They're about to apologize to this person. Um, how this <clears throat> Excuse me, how this resonates. An apology is not enough. Know this. An apology is not enough. Know this. So an apology isn't enough, apparently. Libra masculine lawyer. I meant not lawyer. I didn't hear you were a lawyer. Just a Libra masculine. I was pulling in that Libra masculine lawyer. You're a Libra masculine. I heard the apology is not enough. It's not enough. So if you're thinking about apologizing to this person, just know the apology is not enough. There needs to be something else there, apparently. Action or something. I don't know. Information or what have you, what have you. I don't know. But I just heard the apology isn't enough. So you want to apologize to this person, but it's not enough. Just know this. It's not. Definitely not enough. Definitely not enough. So the throat chakra here is the apology, but I heard it's not enough. So, I mean, I guess you can try to apologize to this person, but I heard it's not enough. Whatever you did was pretty damn shitty, whoever you are, sir, um, and how this applies. Now, whether you can come back and make it better, I don't know. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. So if you're truly sorry, you would want to try to make it better. So hopefully that can help you think about things before you try to apologize to this person, whoever this person is. Only you know who this person is, not anybody else. Flute, disappointment in a friend or lover. I think this goes with the betrayal energy, with the groupies and the orgies and the sex parties and the what have you, what have you. That's just disgusting just thinking about that shit. And that's just the truth. A Libra masculine is about to find out their co-worker is dating somebody. It is about to really upset them, but they know there's nothing they can do about it. For some, it is a subordinate under them. Okay, so for one of you guys, you're about to find out your co-worker is dating somebody. It's going to make you disappointed. For some, it is a subordinate under you. Um, in your workplace situation, and it's gonna make you disappointed. But I heard there, you know, there's nothing you can do about it. Well, hopefully, no retaliation or sabotage or anything crazy. Um, because you get your feels involved. Just saying, just saying. A uh, Libra's. Some a teenage child, some an adult child is about to experience alcohol poisoning soon. Way too much partying. Life-threatening. One of these situations, they will end up passing away. Oh my God, whoa. So you plug it in, how it resonates. That's terrible. So for one of you guys, you have a teenager. For one, you have an adult child. Um, 18 or 18 plus. I heard... Um, they're going to experience alcohol poisoning. So an extreme excess use of alcohol, basically. Ex I mean, just alcohol after alcohol. After, I mean, party, party, party. Probably doing the keg shit. Um, but I heard basically um, one of them will end up passing away. One of them will end up passing away because they will be so alcohol intoxicated. I had a cousin that um, in college, he um, almost died from alcohol intoxication. True story. Um, but one of these situations, they will pass away. One, they will not. For some, it is a teenager child of yours, um, whether it's biological or foster child. For one, it is an adult child, biological or foster, foster child. So you're going to be disappointed in their choices. I heard, uh, I think it's a kegger. I think it's a kegger or a frat party or something like that. Um, I don't know. I was never in the cool crowd. I have went to community college at freaking 30 years old. So I was never in the cool crowd. I was never in a sorority. I was never in a fraternity or what have you, what have you. Nor did I ever, would ever have the interest to be in that shit. But how that resonates, somebody's kid is, I feel. I feel they're in a sorority or a fraternity or the cool kid clique. 
Um, and they're about to get around the wrong people and about to go to a party involving alcohol, and they're about to experience alcohol intoxication. One of these people, they will pass away. Death energy, you guys, for one of them. One, it's a teenager, minor energy. One, it's an adult. This is strong. Somebody needs to parent their kids more correctly. And I'm just, it'd be my niece to hear that. Death, pay attention to your work. A Libra masculine is about to get so overwhelmed in their workplace situation soon. So overwhelmed. There's about to be error after error after error after error after error. The work is just about to pile on. Okay, I heard a Libra masculine is about to get so over. I'm going in. I don't think I had one message for a Libra fam. So much Libra masculine. So a Libra masculine is about to get so um, overwhelmed in his work. For some, you're an officer of the law. For some, you're an RN. For some, you're a lawyer. For some, you're an officer of the law. For some, you're an RN. For some, you're a lawyer. For some, you work at a restaurant. For some, manufacturing. For some, a restaurant. For some, manufacturing. For some, Walmart. For some, Walmart. So you plug it in how it resonates, but um, you're about to get overwhelmed. Um, business is about to pick up um pick up whether you own your own business or you work at those places like walmart or um i heard for one year rn so that could be a skilled nursing facility dialysis clinic a hospital um uh, what have you what have you um community health i mean i don't know but it's about to start coming the work is about to start coming fast about to overwhelm the hell, hell out of you and you're about to get very overwhelmed Whoever you are and how this applies to whatever situation you're in there. There's a lot of workplace situations there. Okay? But I heard it's going to cause a lot of errors. And a lot of complaints. And a lot of complaints. It's going to cause a lot of errors and a lot of complaints. So you plug it in how it resonates, um, sir. Leave your mask on. It's about to wake you up in a huge way. It's about to wake you up in a huge way. So the complaints, the overwhelming work, the complaints, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, is about to wake you up in a huge way. For one, you're a doctor. For one, you're a doctor. And for, oh, my God. I hope you don't. Oh, my God. I hope you don't. Um, oh, my God. I hope you don't do surgery or some shit or in clinic procedures. Um, I don't want no, nobody putting a, making a fucking error on me. Um. That's why I self-care my own damn self. I don't want nobody doing no damn surgery on me. That could be where that cosmetic shit's about to back, um, go all haywire. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. Nay, nay. I'll stay up here my damn self. And that's just the truth. Mm. Hammock, taking a vacation physically or mentally. I wonder if this is going to cause a medical malpractice lawsuit with the doctor. And I'm serious. Maybe you need to take some self-care, sir. Leave your masculine doctor. Maybe you need to take some self-care um, and take a break. Um, because you're working on people's bodies, sir. Whatever the hell you're doing. I don't know. I didn't hear what kind of um, doctor you are. Are you neurology? Are you urology? Are you gynecology? I don't know. But you stay the hell away from my body. And that's just the truth. Hammock, taking vacation physically or mentally. A very toxic Libra feminine is about to try to move countries soon and quickly. However, through many series of chain events, she will be stopped. Many people are about to realize her plans here and they're about to stop her. Huge criminal. Okay, I heard a Libra fem is basically about to try to skip country. Um, skip country, but basically many people are about to wake up and realize that's her plan, and she's about to try to skip country. 
She probably is going to try to skip country because if she skips countries, it'll be harder to extradite her back to the country that she committed the crime of crimes in. That's my guesstimate on this. But I heard many people are basically getting a huge wake-up call about this, and um, they're about to basically stop her to where she don't um, leave. So, so where where they don't have to, you know, go through the whole legal process of extraditing her, I'm presuming. So this is escape route energy here, um, fleeing the country. So they will have to actually extradite. Oh Lord. And a Libra masculine is about to one take a staycation, one take a vacation by themselves. Much needed. Okay, and a Libra is about to take, some of you guys, Libras, you're going to take a staycation. Some you're going to take a vacation by yourself. So I think a vacation outside of your area, but by yourself. And one, a staycation. So I think in your home or your workspace, not your workspace, but your home space, pick your feet up and relax, chillax. Um, maybe by yourself, maybe by, by, maybe not. I don't know. A hammock in somebody's backyard is very significant. A barbecue is very significant. A hammock in someone's backyard is very significant and a barbecue is very significant. So this could be you with a hammock in your backyard or somebody you're connected to with a hammock in your backyard. And a barbecue, you could be uh, having a barbecue and inviting people over or somebody's going to invite you over for a barbecue. However, that resonates, uh, Libra. Congrats, whoever that's for. I don't interact with nobody in my fucking community because they're so fucking toxic. And that's just the truth. Every last fucking bit of them. And that's just the truth. I want to win my fucking kids back and I want to fucking move. And that's the goddamn truth. And if anybody calls me asking if I want to sell my home, no, I'm not fucking interested. Because I've never told anybody I wanted to sell my home. I want to make that very abundantly clear. Because I've been getting a lot of phone calls from many different um, real estate companies asking if I want to sell my home. No, I don't. I'm going to rent it out. Make myself some fucking money, because that makes some freaking mental sense. Just saying, just saying. Be my needs to hear that. Blue jeans and tennis shoes are about to become very significant in Libra's life. Blue jeans and tennis shoes are about to become very significant in a Libra's life. So blue jeans and tennis shoes. Maybe you like blue jeans or tennis shoes or somebody you're connected to is going to wear some blue jeans or tennis shoes or somebody looks good in some blue jeans and tennis shoes. I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates, you guys. Let me see if there's anything else. M K H L M K H L J J S R S R Okay, that could be a first, middle, or last initial of you or somebody you're connected to. Um, I'm not going to say them all again. That was a lot of them. So you can go back and um, fast forward back if you need to check them. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. All right. I love you guys. Hope this helped and I'm safe.